right, welcome back to another Toy Show unboxing. Today we're going to unbox a Transformers Legacy Evolution Hot Shot figure. Getting Amazon to the day to the rescue. It is, did was there even bubble wrap in this or no? No, I love that. That's fun. And then yeah. we also got a double whammy of the plastic-free Hasbro packaging. Hey, you know what, though? But at least you can see the figure. When you turn it around, notice that it's not held in by the white plastic tie thingies. It's a piece of, like, twine. And you can see some of the figure. Yeah, I mean, no. I like that they call Evo Fusion just a non-action version of the gimmick that the original Hot Shot toy had. The original Hot Shot, if you put a Minicon on him, it spun a cannon around over his head. Oh, instructions. Look at that. Other instructions. Nah, that's just disclaimer nonsense. I'll tell you what, when we were young, Transformers instructions were better. They were a, full color. Is this a salt pack? Or is this a moisture thing? Or is this actually the, something that comes with it? Probably his gun. It only comes with one gun, right? It's ridiculous. It would have been funny if I would have missed the bucket. <laughs> what like, what's going on here? Is this serious? Lord. Oh, what's there one holding him <laughs> shut? Who the fuck tied him up? Dick Dastardly? Jesus Christ. <laughs> what happened here? Cool, I don't even have to think about anything to put there now. I know, right? You're welcome. At your service. Yeah, you know, some of these guys are like bionicles. Is it me? Right. Yeah. That was me. Okay. No, you're 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 right. Hey, Terrence. I can't believe that. Does that visor uh, on his face, does that tilt up? Let's see. Yes, it does. Awesome. Indeed. Indeed. I mean, it looks like Hot Shot. I see some uh, some weird stuff. Like, I don't remember Hot Shot's windows being in his legs. I thought they were part of the torso. But it's been so long. No idea. Person on. But. See him with the blaster in the hand. Is that what this is? Yeah, it's his little engine gun. Oh, robot mode is not bad. It looks like it stands good. Yeah, it looks like he's supposed to look so. Pretty good. I don't know, I'd rate it pretty, you know. Oh, they transform me? I don't know what to tell you. Good. It's good stuff. Robot mode, good so far. Good so far. All right. Well, let's see how, the, how it goes for the rest of the review. All right. And now we're back. We're going to rate the, the alt mode. Car, yeah, car mode. I don't know. He's a cool car. I like that. He's got, he's got some gun. He's got a gun on the. Hood. He looks, looks like a muscle car. He looks exactly like he did Lucky. Lucky on the me. old show. You know what I think is kind of messed up? No, it would be kind of messed up if they came with a tiny Paul Lamatt figure to go in there. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of messed up that it has a peg for Jolt in it, Swiss. Yeah. I guess if you had the Jolt. You should probably put it on there. Yeah, and I guess that's kind of cool. But that's pretty cool. It's pretty, pretty good. I don't have a that's gift so for pretty, pretty good. 
<laughs> Make one. Yeah, I can do that. Um, always, if you like our videos, like, subscribe, comment. Uh, All right, get us 250 subscribers, and we'll open the Hasbro Pulse. There's a lot to say all at once. Hasbro Pulse, G.I. Joe Classified, Serpentor, and his air chariot. As always, thank you for watching Toy Show. Have a great day, and I'll see you next time. Good night.